Hi and welcome back, I'm Chris. A group of choppers was flying over the city, but the one Black Hawk chopper that's lagging behind was forced to land in the middle of dense traffic. It also took down two lampposts on the way down. This chopper was flying behind a race truck when it touched it with the landing SIDS. Luckily, any disasters were averted quickly. Lighting a jet engine up close looks super fun! These guys climbed the snowy mountain, but then needed help getting down. Then this helicopter managed to make the landing right on the edge of the cliff. The winds were so strong that night that they managed to tip over the helicopter, despite the crew's effort to bring it back. This clip won the repertoire of an FA-18 fighter jet. And this is what it looks like when they're using the full afterburner. These kids snuck into the area where the helicopter was parked, got on top of the rotor blades and used them as a seesaw. Andalan! <laughs> Di Papua pakai baling-baling helikopter. <laughs> Even though the footage looks like it's been taken straight out of a post-apocalyptic horror movie, it's actually just an MD-87 spraying fire retardant. This pilot actually managed to get an entire Antonov AN-26 stuck in a puddle of mud. Then he tried pulling it out. It looked like there was nothing wrong with the landing, but if you look closely at the rear landing gear, it got broken before fully landing. These two Polish F-16 fighter jets do an air-to-air -air flyby on a red sunset. Now that's pretty romantic. Skydiver almost hits the plane as he's going down. Luckily, his parachute opened at precisely the right moment. This man was holding onto the landing skids of a helicopter with one hand and then grabbed the wing of the plane with the other.
This is your flight attendant, Lucy. The video is experiencing turbulence. Please press the like button. Thank you. The Russian Knight's Su-27 tried landing without landing gear, and that's why we see sparks flying from underneath the jet. What looked like a safe landing turned into a horrific accident when the pilot lost control of the helicopter. Luckily, none of the passengers were harmed. These two guys snuck into the airport and got close to the runway to throw rocks at the departing aircraft. In Eastern Europe, people think the lower the plane flies, the cheaper the flight. Hence the plane in the video. This pilot flew his helicopter straight at the incoming train in a daring stunt, but then managed to pull up at precisely the right moment. This helicopter almost crashed on the runway, but the crew quickly got out before there were any casualties. While trying to see if a car could beat a chopper, there was a serious helicopter crash. Luckily, there were no serious injuries after this horrifying incident. This airplane tug was definitely too small for the United Airlines 777, and that's why the wheels started smoking. This man tried to build his own helicopter then got inside and tried to take it off the ground. Never attempt this at home. This is what happens to bags, purses and anything else you have on board a plane that's going zero G during the flight. These Russian guys bought an expensive Mercedes G-Wagon, then tied it to a helicopter and dropped it from about a thousand feet all while drinking vodka. On behalf of the plane crash crew, I'd like to thank you for joining us on this video. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye for now.